Hi everyone! So I hope you're a Harry Potter fan because this video is all based upon creating our own magic Harry Potter spell. Yeah, and this works. I'm not joking and you can create your own. I'm going to give you kind of a little bit of a clue as to what to say but you can change this and make it into your own words. All right, but it's going to be really good for us because at the moment things are a bit weird, aren't they? They're just weird. We're not at school, we're not seeing our friends, we're not you know, people are suddenly working from home and things that weren't before. And yeah, we might be feeling things that aren't as nice as we want to feel. So we might feel a bit sad, we might feel a bit worried, we might feel, you know, a bit stressed. There's lots of things that are going on in our bodies and our heads that we kind of sometimes don't really want to feel. Okay, but that's normal. And it is because none of us are knowing what's going on at the moment. And that does create that. Okay, so don't worry. Don't worry, we're going to magic it away with our Harry Potter spell. Okay, so what I want you first to do is think about what you're feeling. Okay, so when you do feel one of those things, maybe it's sad, so you feel sad. Maybe you feel upset, maybe you feel stressed, whatever it is, or worried or lonely. Yeah, where do you then feel it in your body? Okay, so I'm going to use an example. You can change this for your magic spell, okay? Because we can make many magic spells for this, but they have to be right for you at that time. Okay, so for me at the moment, let's say I'm sad um, because I can't see my friends, okay? And where would I feel sad? I'd feel sad in my heart, okay? So I'd feel sad in my heart because I can't see my friends, okay? Then the end of the spell will be, and it'll always be the same this end bit. The first bit is your bit, and then the second bit is the Harry Potter bit. So you go, so I'm feeling sad in my heart because I can't see my friends yeah then the end bit is I'm going to magic this away so I can feel okay yeah so feeling sad in my heart because I can't see my friends I'm going to magic this away so I can feel okay so if you might be different you might see think feeling feeling worried in my head because I can't I don't know what's going on I'm going to magic this away so I can feel okay. Do you get it? So you make up the first bit, but the end bit has to be, I'm going to magic this away so I can feel okay. Yeah? All right. Now what you're going to do is, and this is the magic bit, okay? So you're going to do this together. You're going to go three, you're going to tap three, say that line, three, the spell, three times. You're going to say the spell three times. And all the time you're going to tap on this. It's called your karate chop point. You ever seen those kung fu people and all this karate chop? It's there, yeah? You're going to tap on that and you're going to say your magic spell. Okay, so three times. Are you ready? So you say yours, yeah, or you can just tap away with me for now for practice. So I'm feeling sad in my heart because I can't see my friends. I'm going to magic this away so I can feel okay. Feeling sad in my heart because I can't see my friends. I'm going to magic this away so I can feel okay. Feeling sad in my heart because I can't see my friends. I'm going to magic this away so I can feel okay. And then what you're going to do after you've said that three times, that's it. Then you're going to tap and you're going to tap, not too hard because you don't want to hurt your head. Okay. You're going to tap lightly there, just where your eyebrow meets your nose. Okay. Then you're going to tap on the side of your eye. Yeah. Then underneath your eye. Don't worry if you forget this, you can watch it again and I'm going to be doing this with you. Then you go under your nose. Then you go on your chin, in between your chin and your lip, that bit, keep tapping. Then you go on your collarbone, just underneath your collarbone, that bony bit here, yeah? And then you're going to go under your arm like a monkey, okay? Not that any of you like monkeys. <laughs> All right, so that's it, and you keep doing that. So we say the spell three times, okay? After you've done that, then you're going to tap. And at first, we're going to tap on that horrible stuff. Yeah, the stuff that we don't want to feel. So you go, I am feeling sad. Sad in my heart. I'm sad because I can't see my friends. I miss them. I do miss my friends. I miss going to school. I want to see them again. I do want to see them again. I feel sad in my heart because I can't. And it does upset me because I can't play with them like I want to. And I do want to play with them. But I'd like to magic this away. I want to magic this away so I feel okay. Okay, so you see what we're doing there? We're tapping on the not so nice stuff first, but that's the magic part, okay? Because we have to do that first 
before we tap on the good stuff. Now, when you keep doing that, you can do that as long as you want until you start to feel a bit better, okay? So whereas at the beginning, you might have felt, oh, this bit's sad. Yeah, you want to start to feel, when you start feeling about this bit sad, you have to say, how sad do I feel? Is it that sad? If it's still that sad, you still need to be doing this. Okay, if it's gone like that and it's gone down and it's gone to that, then you can start tapping in the good stuff. Because there is good stuff to come, okay? So then you start tapping in the good stuff. So when it's about there, yeah, then you start going. But it's okay. I will see my friends. I've magicked it away. This will go. I'm going to see my friends because I will go back to school. We'll play again. And we might go dancing. We might play football. Whatever it is for you, yeah. You say all that good stuff that you're looking forward to. And you tap it in because this is where you're putting the magic stuff in. Because it is going to happen, okay. You still don't know when at the moment, but it is going to happen. Okay, and that makes us feel better, doesn't it? So quick, tap it in. Tap it in. And I will see them. I'll play with it. And name your friends. Name all your friends who you're going to see. Yeah, and how you're going to feel and how much better you'll feel when this is magic to wear. Okay, and you just keep doing that. Keep doing that. Okay, then eventually you're going to feel miles better. And the magic spell works. And you can use this for anything. Yeah, it doesn't have to just be for one thing. So if you're feeling sad, if you like I said, if you're feeling sad, upset, whatever you don't want to feel. So that's stuff that you don't want to feel. Then you go to a certain place. You can do it in your room. You can do it, you know, I think Harry Potter used to do spells all over, didn't he? Okay. I think he even did them under the stairs. <laughs> but wherever you want to do your spell. Okay. But just take yourself off and do that little spell. Or you can do it with your mum and dad. Whoever's there to help you, they might do this with you as well. All right. So I hope that's helped anyway. And it will magic away those things that you don't want to feel at the moment. All right. Bye.